yourself and just be yourself. It's really that easy. It's really that easy. My friends, it is nice to meet you. My name is Chris Oliver, and while my story is insane, I just have to ask that you believe that I am not. <laughs> At least no more than uh, your average man. We have been infested. We have been infested spiritually by another species. They are here among us. Chris Oliver. While my story is insane, I assure you, I am not. <laughs> and you're really not going to believe me if I keep laughing after I say that, but it is, uh, it's true. It's just the most insane story I've ever had to tell. Um, and I need you to stay with me, at least to the end, so you can see. Lots of outtakes of me laughing because I just have to keep doing this to get it out to make this first video. I promise <laughs> in the future I will try not to do it uh, without giggling, but that is my only defense against my insane story. To my point, we have been infested by a malevolent species. We are surrounded by demons, actual, factual demons. They run our governments, they run our militaries, they run our police forces. I know how this sounds. I know exactly how this sounds, but I have good news. I have very, very good news to go along with that. They cannot hurt us. Their only tools are fear, uncertainty, and doubt. That is all they can do. They can scare us. They are very, very good at scaring us. These are demons. These are the most ancient of evils. They have one very beautiful, beautiful flaw, the, the ultimate irony of evil. They hate truth, they hate truth, but they can not lie. They cannot lie, it is the ultimate irony of evil. I think I have a movie for knowing that, but I assure you I tested it, and it is very much true. So, is there someone in your life that is inexplicably rude or just difficult? People who are difficult for difficulty's sake? They are demons. They are demons. And they are very, very easy to identify. You simply have to ask, are you human? Because they cannot lie. They can not lie. Simply ask them, are you human? And if they say yes, <laughs> then they are in fact human. It, it really is that simple. They can not lie to us. They are unable to lie to us. They are unable to hurt us, and they are unable to lie to us. And I must stress, you do not need to attack them. You do not need to trap them, you just need to expose them. You need to know that they are demons. There is a secret war going on that demons are winning because no one knows they're there. And they've gotten cocky. And if you look at <laughs> if you look at a lot of things, and I will happily answer any questions you have, um, they've gotten arrogant and cocky and they think none of us can see what's going on. And I love you all, but right now that is true, and you all need to wake up and realize the world we live in. You are surrounded by demons. They cannot hurt you. You do not need to hurt them, but you do need to ask one very silly question. Are you human? If they cannot answer directly, yes, they are not human. It is really that simple. I love you like God loves you. I love you more than you know. It took me 38 years to realize it, but all the fear that had been fed into me about my fellow man, it wasn't from my fellow man. It was from demons. And now that I have realized this, I have been set free. And I want to take you with me. That is all I want. I do not want your money. I do not want your praise. I want you to be free. 
I want you to come with me. But first, we have to literally confront the demons. I love you. All right, all right, water. <laughs> <laughs> 